a fresh cup of coffee. That's all many of us want most mornings. But if you're one of the millions using single serve coffee pods, your Java is brewing up a lot of garbage. So companies are scrambling now to make that convenient cup greener. Renee Filipponi reports. A solution is brewing slowly for all the waste created by single serve coffee pods. Companies that make them are working on a guilt free cup of Java. Right now, there isn't an option for a, a very easily separable, recyclable cup, so we think it's going to be a big differentiator in the market. The world is already littered, literally, with billions of coffee pods. Millions of Canadians have a machine, but many are uneasy about the amount of garbage it creates. They give themselves an A grade in terms of their environmental awareness, so they, they would like to do the right thing, they just don't want it to be too difficult or too costly. Now the coffee pods are made up of a mixture of materials which make them difficult to recycle. First there's the top which is a tin foil layer that has to be disposed of. Then there's the organic material, the coffee inside. You also have the filter and the plastic cup. Taking these apart can be a real challenge. This Ontario company says all its single serve coffee will be packaged in an easy to take apart eco cup by early next year. In many communities, the plastic portion can be recycled. Still, two pieces of it will end up in the trash. On the West Coast, compostable is seen as a solution. But that's not so easy either. It's hard to find an organic material that fits the bill and keeps the coffee fresh. If you think about compostable materials, they typically fall apart, of course. That doesn't usually go hand in hand with going through a production process in a plant. The company that developed the K-Cup, Keurig Green Mountain, pledges to have a fully recyclable product by 2020. But if you don't want to wait, this is a solution available right now. These recycle boxes for Keurig compatible pods can be purchased online. The consumer is covering the cost of all the shipping and sorting and storage and of course the recycling of all the waste. Fill the box with your pods and send it off for someone else to dispose of responsibly. There is also the option of a reusable pod, but it's less convenient. For Phil Anderson, the shame brews alongside his coffee. I barely had made a couple, cup, a couple cups of coffee and my wife kind of said that machine's going to go. <laughs> his machine is now for sale online. Renee Filipponi, CBC News, Toronto. Keurig isn't the only culprit when it comes to hard to recycle coffee pods. Tassimo and Nespresso are two other market leaders. Their pods need to be taken apart for recycling and it isn't easy to do. Tassimo pods can be disposed of using an online service. Nespresso's can be recycled in store.